Hey guys, it is snowing, it's cold, and it's currently um, 8, still very dark outside, but we are going to a dental appointment at the moment, so I thought why not, let me carry you guys out. It's snowing and someone is actually out already walking their dogs. Let's rush to the appointment. I don't even know if you guys can see me by now, but let's continue with this vlog, shall we? So I have just arrived at the hospital, so I'm waiting for my dental appointment. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to like vlog. actually my first dental appointment since coming from Kenya it's been bad yeah I've been trying to get this appointment but it's taken this long to get it so, so excited for my teeth it has really snowed today I'm so excited to go back and play with the boys outside um, yeah do you guys find this hair look or not because I don't know I just have to find out some your style to to my hair. So I was telling you guys about my teeth problem. So um, I had like teeth staining before and then I had to like get them fixed and then the guy the dentist that I went to see actually drilled into my teeth I think way too much in uh, of course he was trying to get rid of the staining it destroyed my enamel and so um, the inside like he had to cover the front teeth this teeth that's why they look a little bit different he had to cover them with um, some um, I don't know what it's called the thing they use to cover the teeth now the one that he had put is not a good one so I have to like get it all corrected um, I've been trying to get this appointment but it's really taken long but uh, my front teeth are really really sensitive really sensitive so I think it was to tell the other me that was getting rid of the dots in my teeth I would just not have done it but it was really stupid uh, but I did it anyway so no regrets um, but yeah that's the repercussion I have to live with so I think today I made it on time I'm being called into this room here this one anytime soon so i'm just waiting for my name to be called and then i'll go in but actually let me show you guys what i'm wearing today okay
lähetän sulle keväällä ajan. Joo, 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 joo. That's the forest. I don't want to go in the forest anymore. Because there's... Because it is... Some insects which, which, which takes the blood from people. I don't like it. Mosquitoes are gone now, Matthew. Okay, Mena. So we have come on top of the hill. If you've ever watched my videos from before, remember I showed you guys the staircase where we actually go for exercise. So currently, that's where we are at the moment. So, yep, I'll show you guys how we do it. Hey guys, so currently showing you our Christmas must do, which is our train layout, and I'm so excited to introduce to you the 2020-2021 train look for the year. We might be changing this because we might be moving out really soon, but for the meantime, this is what we worked with. We have our gingerbread house. I'm just so excited about the whole of this project and you can see our train clearly. We are lovers. So this is what we work with for the Christmas holidays. Hubby and the kids really enjoy doing this and the kids have been loving this and using it like all the time. Daniel clearly loves trains as well as Matthew and Adrian too. So this has just been a win-win-win and for the love of train, it's always amazing. So I I love how this looks spectacular, gorgeous, and well detailed train layout. But I the Mine is out. Okay, let me take this. Let's I will just, I will just taste this. No, I don't want to be taste. I like it first. I to the. So right here we had gone to Helsinki um, city center for some Christmas dinner shopping. Unfortunately everything was closed but we still had fun so enjoy with, with the kids. <laughs> Uh, 
snowfall that has been like with a lot of snow so we're pretty much going to enjoy this like every every minute of it so yeah how are you guys doing today how's your christmas did you guys have fun Nyam chum barbecues what did you guys have for christmas and i'm just hoping that everyone actually is fine so yeah i was actually thinking and you guys let me know down below i saw a survey where it's like a finnish men trying to like a survey about finnish men on dating and relationships would you guys want me to sit down with my husband and try and whip up something like that for you guys i guess someone is looking into marrying in finland or something like that i, I mean i think it's it's like a nice conversation to have between couples or just to know about other cultures so yeah um on that side note i feel like i look down it's really cold um kids are just playing around there are people walking their dogs and stuff like that um more of a finnish culture kind of thing and yeah so pretty much nothing weird um happening hey yeah so See, there's are people walking the ihana <laughs> there's are people walking their dogs so yeah um it's beautiful i'll say it's so beautiful it's so pretty it's so pretty so pretty anyway uh, so we got left behind they went oops oh god i wore the right wrong type of shoes for this mission well, yeah guys let me just say this i think 2020 has been um a tough year but i feel like i have enjoyed 2020 i don't know you guys tell me what you think there's adrian and matthew just playing around them throwing snowballs sorry And that's the man's. Isa, say hey. Hey. Mommy. Uh huh. Hello. Where's Adrian? Hello. Ooh. Mommy. That's Adrian. Yeah. And there is. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's here too. That's a playing of a thing. Ooh. Did you hit him? Daniel is over there. It's really windy as well, so that's why Daniel is still on the pram. Um, yeah, wow, I look cute. I look cute. Even if it's windy, I still love the way it looks out here. Mm. Isn't it just the best dad in the world? I love this one. Like, I really do love him. Really do love him. Hello. Love you, sweetheart. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you almost leg. got his le leg. Oh, that did not get that far. behind there trying to get us dinner ready and I am the sous chef I think actually I'm taking care of the kids as he cooks and there's, there's a, a warning right if you're vegan or vegetarian look away now right? <laughs> <laughs> this is not a I'm going to take all of our total meat blowout so it was like so vegans should look away <laughs> it's a meat overload I mean there are vegetarian ingredients Ah, like the nuts, for example. Nuts and cranberries and onions and yeah. garlic and all these good things. But uh, unfortunately, it's not uh, vegetarian. Okay. When the kids are currently busy, Matthew is over the train uh, station. Adrian and Daniel are watching something at the moment. So yeah, um, let's cook. Isa, take that man walk. Can your man cook? I think. Oh, like this. My husband is not the recipe, what he remembers. 
Um, so I think corn flour is okay. Um, so this is good. I think, Mom, you did a wonderful job. Like you really did a wonderful job. It was a British one. It's got uh, there's a stuffing. Well cooked on the top, but it's, it's good on the bottom. Kind of gravy, classic gravy made from the, the chicken juices and so on. Um, Brussels sprouts. You can have it. Thumbs up, okay. Chicken, it's not a huge chicken, but then we have plenty of stuffing. We're actually late shopping, so. And we shall continue. Yep. All together. Cheers. They do it all together. Christmas and mm -hmm. all together. Mm -hmm. Surviving mm -hmm. coronavirus. Mm -hmm. Because we had it. Mm -hmm. And a happy new year. Mm -hmm. yeah, Daniel wants to toast. Yeah, Careful now. There you go, Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy. Toast to Daddy. Keep toast, Daniel. Cheers. Cheers. Daniel toast to, to Daddy's pudding. Yeah. Oh, to great cooking. Mm -hmm. Today is great cooking. Uh. Isa. There you go, Daniel. Kitas. 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 I'm actually trying to get a little dark. Hey, Ben Roca. Hi, Yoda. Who are you, Roca? Hi, Yoda. Who are you, Roca? Hi, Yoda. Who are you, Roca? Hi, Yoda. stretched us has finally come to an end it's a new beginning a new era a new dawn guys i can't believe i'm living in 2021 as i'm recording this voice over leave it go for it you can achieve it you are unstoppable and thank you so much for the support that you have given me through this year bye